The Lord has been showing me that there is a settling that is taking place by His hand right now. There are many who have been feeling like they have been living in a place of being continually uprooted and feeling like they have been living in what feels like an extended period of transition. I heard the Lord speaking over these ones, you have entered your settled season, and I saw the Lord leading these ones into places where roots were going down deep, and there was an occupying of the land taking place. I kept hearing the sound of a large exhaling in the spirit, and it was the sound of rest. It was the sound of being settled and for many it was a place of finding home. The Lord spoke to me that this settling for many would be geographical. There are many who the Lord has been moving from place to place over in short periods and constant movement and transition and their hearts have been crying out for the place of being settled, roots going deep, and home established. I saw for many in this hour, He was leading them into a land of rest, a land of being established and roots going down deep into the land, for many, they were moving into places of occupying land in the natural, to be able to build and establish home and the time of constantly being shifted and uprooted was over. The Lord also showed me that there was a deep settling and establishing of His hand taking place right now more than ever to build for future generations and longevity on a scale we have never seen. The Lord showed me the outpouring in these established places will be unprecedented like we have never seen before. The Lord also showed me that some of these geographical places many are being settled in were bursting forth as houses of prayer and homes of worship that are going to bring major shifts to regions. The Lord also showed me that the settled season for many was a place of moving from constantly living in a place of deep battle, deep contending and deep weariness over so much of what God has spoken, into the place of flourishing fulfillment. There was a deep peace that He was bringing into hearts and souls of many that was coming from the place of fulfillment, and coming from the place of stepping into inheritance of fulfilled promises. There was no longer the deep grief of battle after battle, long year after long year of unfulfilled promises, but it was a time to move into the land of harvest and fruitfulness, and roots being established in a land that was thriving and flourishing, rather than living in a place of constantly tending what seems to be dry, hard ground that went from barren to what felt like even more barren with each passing year. There was a settledness in the manifestation of the promises of God. It was a double recompense and flourishing fulfillment. The Lord also showed me that the settled season for many was a place where He was bringing His people into the place of deep rested faith. It was the deeper revelation of what it means to be in Him, and at home in Him. It was a deep fortification of faith. It was a deep place of rested faith, Hebrews 4.11, in Him where many inner turmoils were quieted and a deep fortified trust in Him without wavering. There was a deep settledness and maturity that was being forged within that is faith and hope in Him like an anchor no longer being battered around by storms, but being in a place of strength and immovable in the storms. There was a deep immovable peace within that was flourishing that saw many steps into an increase of awakening to their authority in Christ where they see storms shift and move in Jesus' name, rather than storms shift and move them. Such deep rest is upon many in this place of settledness. It's a place of recovery. It's a place of reward. It's a place of recompense. It's a place of being established, grounded, and founded in Him, but also in places and positions of His assignment. For many of you, you have continually looked around in your life and thought, I simply live in transition after transition, battle after battle, stretching after stretching, where is the fulfillment of all God's has spoken. Now you shall see, says the Lord. Things are going to happen so fast your head will swim, one thing fast on the heels of the other. You won't be able to keep up. Everything will be happening at once, and everywhere you look, blessings. Blessings like wine pouring off the mountains and hills. I'll make everything right again for my people Israel, they'll rebuild their ruined cities. They'll plant vineyards and drink good wine. They'll work their gardens and eat fresh vegetables. And I'll plant them, plant them on their own land. They'll never again be uprooted from the land I've given them. God, your God, says so.